Hello everyone, welcome, Gakamas here, and today, this may look a bit different to normal, but yes, I'm going to be uh, bringing you a how-to. Um, I was a bit confused, because, uh, obviously, now you can have two game modes, you can have creative or survival. So I thought, hmm, well, that would be quite a good idea. Uh, map designers, who create custom maps, can now use the creative mode to, to create a map, put it into survival, and then it would be a brilliant map, it's just an easier way of creating it. So, I was looking, tried to figure out how to how to change it, and I came up quite negative quite a bit. Uh, I figured out what you'd have to do is open up the saved file in your um, .minecraft file, and change the level, the level, <coughs> sorry, the level uh, .dat. So I had to look up how to open a the dot dat and uh, I failed miserably. Uh, but I did find one program. Uh, this one here is created by this guy. I think I think it's created anyway. Uh, it's called NBT Edit, and what this does is it opens up the dot dat file so you can change it basically. Um, so I'm just gonna gonna close that down actually. I'm just gonna go. I created a little creative mode map here. I haven't done much to it. I've built a little house. I have unlimited blocks, break thing. I can't get it to fly for some reason. There we go. I've got flying. And I've got the massive inventory full of unlimited shit. It's brilliant. Um, So I've created just a tiny little house. I put a chest with a few things inside it. Just for fun I guess. <laughs> and uh, I am now going to show you how to make this into a survival map. Uh, there is one little problem with it which I'll show you after I've done it. So anyway just go... Oh, so I'm just going to close Minecraft down. So once you've downloaded the NBT edit, extract it and put it into a little file, then open this one here. This will bring this little screen up and what you need to do is open Oh, I've already got it in the right place. But uh, if you say if you're just on the desktop, you need to go to where your like Minecrafting is. So, so you can click uh, Mine's Gakamus, then App Data, which might be hidden. So you may have to show hidden, or I'll show the alternative to do it. Then Roaming, Minecraft, Saves, and then find the file that's the creative one. Or alternatively, you could change a non-creative. Sorry, my headphone was making an annoying movement thing. Yeah, you can change um, a survival into a creative this way as well. It doesn't really matter, but I think it would be more beneficial to change a creative into a survival. So, open up that, and then it will be level that. I mean, I tried opening it in a notepad, so that's why it's showing as a notepad file. But just open that, and then you get this. Just maximise... Uh, <coughs> the list and you get all of these things so not 100% sure what map features does but you can make it so it's raining whether it's thundering uh, the game type which is what you need the game type but anyway uh, and you've got loads of other things you can go open this one down the bottom here and it shows you all of your stats this the level dot that is basically what the get what Minecraft reads to open up uh, to, to show where you're starting and what you've got in your inventory and all that type of shit. Um, so we do double click on game type. One is creative. Zero is survival. So change it to zero. Don't forget to click on the save. I'm going to leave this open for now. Log in. Just wait for it to load. And now you may be able to see here it now says survival mode. So we double click on that. Open it up. Blah -de blah. Oh, oh, I can now destroy stuff normally. This stuff's still in the chest. However, you may notice that the thing that I was a bit like, oh, damn it, is the fact that whatever you've got in your inventory is converted over. Yeah, you've only got... Let's just put that down. You've only got one of it, but it does convert over, so you may want to empty your inventory before you do this, or just throw everything away. I mean, it is good because it, it does mean you can actually start survival maps um, with, like, a sword or um, some food or some armor. 
Uh, which is pretty neat. And obviously the stuff's still here in the chest. I'm not sure if I've already said that. So that's that's the one way of how I've figured out to change a map into survival. And then obviously you can just go back, change it to one. I don't know why I shut Minecraft. It was a stupid thing to do. And then we're back in creative mode. It seems to have given me the items back though, so I'm not sure if there is an easier way. There probably is an easier way. And until someone creates a mod where it's just a simple one click thing, this is one of the only ways. And I think it's the simplest way. I did see another way online, but I was just like, what? Well, I'm confused. I don't understand this. I'm just going to ignore it. <laughs> Basically, I was just like, that's that just seems like too much effort. It involves like the seed and some copy and paste in and blah, 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 blah. So, yeah, so this this is how, as far as I'm aware, well, this is the easiest way to convert a file. I mean, oh, yeah, I was going to show you the other way. The other way, if you open this, click on open, uh, let's just go back to the desktop, and you can't figure out how to get to your thing. I mean, it's easy. I go on desktop and it's right there. What you can do is click up here, per percentage sign app data, close percent, well, another percentage sign, click on it, and it will bring up this thing here. Then you just click on your Minecraft and your saves and blah, 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 blah. So you could do it for any map you've got. Uh, I've got a shitload of maps that I've downloaded and played. Yeah. So... Yeah, um, f this is this is everything. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, I hope this was informative. Uh, most of my videos aren't informative, so it's quite a rare thing for me to do this. Um, hopefully this has come out alright and you can see anything. If you've got any questions, uh, feel free to leave a comment. Um, and yeah, just to spread the word of this video because I've not seen any videos of this online. So yeah, um, thank you for watching and goodbye. Stuff still in the chest. However, you may notice that the thing that I was a bit like, oh damn it, is the fact that whatever you've got in your inventory is converted over. Yeah, you've only got, let's just put that down, you've only got one of it.